Hello and welcome to this group of videos on the subject of sound editing for pictures to Axie. My name's Barry Beckham. PTE offers two versions of its software, the lower cost Essentials and the Deluxe version. Remember you can always upgrade from the Essentials to the Deluxe version at any time at www winsoft that's w n soft s o f t dot com one of the differences between the two versions is how they approach sound editing both are going to create superb audiovisual sequences with your help of course but the videos in this set are primarily aimed at the deluxe version The sound editing options in the deluxe version of Pictures to Exe are far more comprehensive than the Essentials version, but having said that, I have included a video that looks at sound editing from the perspective of the Essentials version of Pictures to Exe. And as a part of this group of videos, we do look at the free sound editing software Audacity, where we find it, how we download it, and how we install it. So if you are a PTE Essentials user, those Audacity videos will be very useful to you. Now it may be interesting for Pictures to Exe Essential users to know that way back when there was no sound editing capability at all, within Pictures to Axie, most of us enthusiasts used Audacity all the time. It will meet all of your needs. So within the group of videos I'm presenting, I've tried to cover every sound editing need you're likely to need. And I've presented that information in over 20 short videos, running on average for about 8 minutes each. The download includes a number of techniques including converting domestic CDs to MP3 music files, understanding pictures to exe music tracks and audio, reducing our music length and fading sounds in and out. I've included various techniques for extending and joining music track lengths including crossfade. We look at audio key points and multiple track sound editing with music, sound effects and commentary. We look at the free sound editing software Audacity, always good to have at our disposal even if we only ever use it to reduce noise and hiss in our sound files, something which we cover in this group of videos. We also look at commentary, how to write the script techniques on recording it and applying it to our presentation. I've also demonstrated the techniques on how we can edit the sound on any movie we place in our slideshow. To locate this group of videos that you can download and have on your desktop in less than 15 minutes, just come to the address you can see up at the top left www.beckhamdigital.com.au Remember our prices are in Australian dollars. In the search field at the top of the page put 9-007 and you will be taken straight to sound editing.